Welcome everybody to our YouTube channel called Fast CPA and Consultants. I'd like to introduce our CPA, Fulton Abraham Sanchez. Welcome, Fulton. Thank you, Osara. If you're here for the first time, we've created this series called Tax Talks, where you send us your question. And today's topic is taxes for foreigners with business in the USA. We have our first question. What taxes are paid when selling a property in the USA as a foreigner? For foreign citizens not living in the USA and having a, a property in the US, they have to pay a what is called capital gains. Capital gains is the capital gain tax. Capital gain tax is the tax that is paid over the difference between the sales price and the cost of the property. When you purchase the property at the beginning, you have a cost. When you sell the property, there is now a sales price. The di that difference is applicable for the uh, capital gains tax. This capital gains tax goes uh, up to 20%. Many times it's 15%, depending on the amount of the profit. Other times it's less, 10%. I've seen pro tax uh, capital gain tax of 5%, uh, but it's between between 0 and 20%. This is, all, this is when there is the sale of a property. Remember, this is capital gains tax. Understood. Second question. What tax obligations does an LLC have with foreign owners that does not have any operations? Um, if there are no operations for the LLC, for example, and uh, there are transactions between the owner and the LLC, and this LLC is one owner, the IRS requires the filing of a report with the movement of the transaction between the owner and the, L and the LLC, when there is one owner. When there are several owners in the, L in the LLC, the IRS requires the filing of a zero report. In, in the two cases with one owner, one owner LLC or multiple owners LLC, there is, there is a requirement of filing a tax return, but, but it depends of the nature of the transactions. For the LLC with two members, it's an obligation to file a return even though there are no transactions. For an LLC with two members or more, either US, own, US citizens or foreigners, there is the obligation to file a tax return even if it's a zero return with, when, the, when there, is, there are no transactions. For an LLC with one member, without transactions, any kind of transactions, then there is no obligation to file. But if there are transactions between the owner, like loans or distributions, and the LLC, the, the owner, the LLC has the obligation to file an informative return reporting those transactions between the owner and the LLC. Understood. Third question. Do I have to be up to date with the IRS if I want to sell my property in the USA as a foreigner? Uh, yes. Now, if this is your first year, first time property, then there is not much to do. Uh, the only way to keep to be on uh, on time or on time to be on record to be up to date with the IRS is filing your returns every year. But that filing every year return is an obligation only for U.S. citizens living in the US or not living in the US. If you are a foreigner and you have an LLC in the US uh, and that LLC owns a property or you have a property in the LLC, you have the obligation to file a reporting the income and expenses of the property. And if there is a, um, what is called a profit for the property, you have to, file, to pay taxes. If there, is, there are no profits in the property after depreciation, it means that you do not have to file because it, it will be a loss. If you have, and just to give an idea, then $10,000 of income and you have $15,000 in expenses, you have a negative $5,000 for the property. If you have a negative balance, there is no reason to file a tax return. So the obligation to file a tax return only is applicable if you have uh, for example, an LLC 
that owns a property that is being rented, you have to file that tax return. If you have, if you own the LLC at your name, the obligation is to file a, a tax return personally and report the the income of uh, the the profits of the of the property. But only if you have those profits. If there are no profits, you don't have any obligation to file. I get it. Um, people who reside with an H-1 visa in the USA, are they obligated to report their income outside of the United States? No, that obligation only is for U.S. citizens. For a foreign citizens holding H-1 visa with working permit and staying in the U.S., they don't need to file for the income that is outside of the U.S. because they are not residents or citizens of the USA. Great. And our last question, when is a foreigner residing in the USA required to report their income outside of USA? When the foreigner becomes a resident or a citizen in the USA, that moment they are obligated to report the income outside of the US. Great, thank you Fulton for your information. That's all of our questions for today. If you have any more questions, you can send them to our email, social media. We have a private Facebook group. We'll put the description down below and we'll see you on the next video. Thank you.